Hey guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting ring to episode zero of season two of Jobless Reincarnation. This is crazy. <laughs> That's all I gotta say about this. Um, oh god, I kind of wish I rewatched like the last couple of episodes because I mean I remember a lot of things, um, but. Oof. Big oof. I feel like th this isn't going to be an episode focused on Rudy. I, I definitely 100% think that. It, it has to be focused on what's her face. Because that's the next person Rudy's looking for besides his mom. So, fuck it. Let's just go ahead and get started in three, two, one, go. I also feel like if I didn't watch this, somebody on one of my patrons would have definitely been like, hey, yo, yo, watch season one. So go ahead and watch season two. Yeah, uh, you wake up and you realize you fall into your death. Oh my god. Poor fucking child. Like, she... <laughs> oh. Exactly. She has to wait. Yeah, you hear that too? A boar? Well, you know, that's one way to make an entrance. Damn, just like that, huh? <laughs>
the question then is like, why the fuck would her hair change? That's why she has the glasses. She looks so badass, oh my god! So, well, just for now, we'll call her fits, then. Makes sense, though. Ain't that funny that her name Ariel? <laughs> <laughs> Well, he seems like an ass.
baby. Oh, shit. No, 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 no. Uh-oh. I mean, that was a good distraction, though, but, like, hey, <laughs> now everybody's not looking at her, but still. Well, I feel like the brother going to have his own damn sister killed. Jesus Christ. <laughs> You fits. No, oh, but you make them like you. Yeah. See, why did I feel like in that moment she was going to lie to her and be like, no, we haven't found anything. You're doing as best as you can.
Why you look like Humpty Dumpty? <laughs> I also feel like Humpty Dumpty is also playing him. Yeah, I don't think- oh, no, oh, never mind, never mind, we're going girls love! All the Yuri. Even though they're not advanced on it, it's still cute. <laughs> Gotta rely on her just as much as she relies on you. I got a bad feeling about this right now. But like that bitch came in trying to kill me. She deader and dead. You can't come back from that.
Okay, now, hold the fuck up. Now, since several people have died, wouldn't it be smart to move them away so that nothing else happens to them? Yes, but just to a safe place where nobody knows where you are. And at least let Luke and Sylvie go with you. So then what the fuck is she supposed to do now? Until she finds Rudy. <laughs> and then she leaving you. I love that we initially got context because the way season two, um, season two, Jesus Christ, the way season one ends where you kind of get the answers of where she is, you're like, okay, whenever the fuck are we going to get answers on how she got to where she is now? And then when the poster started coming out, I was like, yeah, I really need answers on where the fuck she is and how, like, number one, her hair. Two, the outfit she's wearing. Why the fuck is she wearing glasses and stuff? And I love the fact that we initially got the answers on it and such. And of course, like, her and Rudy are definitely going to meet up at that school that Rudy is currently on his way to once we initially get into episode one. Um, but it was good. Now, the <laughs> once again, you never trust siblings in this show, straight up, because anyone everybody has their own agenda agendas and what the fuck they want to do and how capable they are of possibly killing someone to hide the truth Th this fucker Ariel's brother was like yeah go ahead and kill her but like he was a bitch like <laughs> i mean seriously is she, I mean, number one, yes, I get the reason why Ariel is trying to protect her. Because she's new, she's brand new, she's trespassing. So, of course, we gotta conceal, you know, Sophie's identity. So, your new name is now Fitz. And so, no one can really know the truth about you and where the fuck you are from. But because of the fact is the assassin was around here about to kill both of them and such, it makes the most sense to move those three away from the kingdom and such. But something kind of tells me a little teeny tiny bit that her brother will find out slash trace where the fuck she is. And he will definitely go out and search for her. Possibly. I'm not really sure. But it does make me wonder how Rudy is going to 
mm, how is Rhea's story going to connect with Syl's story as of right now? And how are they going to meet each other officially older and such? And is he immediately going to recognize her? Of course not, because her hair is blonde and she looks nothing like she does the only thing that you know he instantly is going to remember is probably maybe the eyes and her ears but i think it will take a little while for these two to truly find each other and to finally have the meeting that i have been wanting when i watched season one but i mean for an obs obs <laughs> an oba style episode it was not that bad it was really good um but I'm definitely expecting more assassins to also come after them as well. So, who, who fucking knows? Mm -mm 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 -mm. And then plus, I'm also thinking, I'm, I'm forgetting, um, what the fuck was her name? Blue, the blue hair magical girl chick who's voiced by, um, Chica. Her. She's looking for Rudy as well. Well, yes. Yes, yeah, from what I remember. See, this uh, literally makes me want to rewatch all of season one because it's been like months <laughs> since I last watched it or finished it. But I mean, yeah, good damn first episode or episode zero and ish. Cannot wait officially for episode one to see how long between the period of where this ended versus the start of season two. So I'm guessing like that bridge gap is not going to be that long. So maybe I would say about a couple of weeks to a month from this portion and then you know eventually Rudy's gonna come in you know get some ass like always but other than that guys that is my reaction to towards episode zero of season two of Jobless Reincarnation if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel I make videos every single night join Master Squad and of course I will see you guys all next time for episode one bye guys